Hey, Noah Waika here. We're out here at Clarks Hill Reservoir at Points West, which is the Army Resort here for Fort Gordon. We're about to drop our sailboat in the water for the first time in five years. That's a 1982 Catalina Capri Cyclone 13, which is a very long name, but John is taking the tie downs off now. We're gonna back it down the boat ramp. Yeah, we'll do all the things, so stay tuned. So these are actually 3D printed mast bunks. It's a PETG that the mast actually sits on, and then I've got a strap over the top. That just comes off with a 9 16 wrench. Not yet, oh yeah. All right, I, I don't know why, but I was thinking that rudder and main sheet were the same person for some reason. Almost. Fighting the wind, that's what it is. Yeah. Oh. I need like a quarter of an inch more. Uh, is it interfering with that mass lock again? Are we got to pull forward? I don't think so. Okay, I have the main sheet. Okay. Oh boy, I'm a little spooked all of a sudden. Me too. Darn. You want me to put it back on? Nope, just check the line to me. Okay, you are free of the dock. Okay. Boom. I think I got a switch size. Um, cinch the alcohol line. Yep, good. Right there is fine. Boom. Where do you want to go, Gumby Cat? Yeah, the wind just died. Heel. Yep. 
Gonna shoot her out a little. <laughs> Making a week. I'm so excited. Ooh. I don't know what happened there. I don't either. Don't mess with the sheep. Yeah, the wings are just trying to be consistent. Sheet in a bit. Good. Okay. You ready? Yeah. Prepare to come about. Okay, jive hose. Okay, he's out. Nice. And the wind is dead. Yeah, we, I was about to say, we just hit a dead spot. Yeah. The wind. I mean, it looks like there's wind to starboard. Getting wind from somewhere. So we're at a run right now. Sort of. Um, the boat's been... Handling great. We are not handling great. The last time that we were on the boat. This um, boat specifically. Yeah, this boat specifically, we had a really, really bad time. So. It almost sank. Um, yeah, we are trying to not stress ourselves out. And we are trying to not be PTSD. Yeah, we're, we're coping with our PTSD, but I the think... weather's great. The, uh, the wind is a little bit inconsistent, but at least it's kind of from the same direction. So. I was not anticipating to react this way. Yeah, I wasn't, I wasn't really <laughs> thinking that I would have this hard of a time with it either, but... Yeah, because you, you've sailed since then. Yep. I have not, so I guess it makes sense for me a little bit. Yeah. Maybe I should have gone out in the canoe first. The deck joint. It oh. Got, like, it was going between the layers of fiberglass. Yeah. Um, which, I don't know how we would dream that, but... Yeah, I don't either. No water at all? All right, so we're done with our sailing day. It was a little bit higher stress than uh, we were hoping for. We have a little bit of PTSD from the last time. So every time the boat would heal more than like 10 degrees, we'd kind of freak out. I think we just need to get more exposure therapy to being on the water. It also doesn't really help that the winds are kind of inconsistent. Yeah. Um, they sort of start to change direction a lot right in the middle of the water. Yeah, this little marina cove here is just kind of difficult to come into. Yeah, come out of and go into. Anyway, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in the next video.